uh, who hails from Kilifi County, and I would really implore on the other members, just like the Honorable Ken Chonga has done, this is not the opportunity to point fingers at each other. And it's unfortunate that the area women rep opted to use this motion as an opportunity to attack the character of the Honorable Owen Bayer. Instead of commending the Honorable Owen Bayer that he has done what he ought to do as a member of parliament is to bring issues that are of concern to the people of Kilifi to the debating house that can resolve issues that are of concern to them. Honorable Speaker, I have also seen a few idle minds, I have to say, Honorable Speaker, move around with photos, Photoshop a photo of uh, this Pastor Mackenzie with a leader, with uh, an MP, and say this is uh, this and this person's friend. And it's really cheap, Honorable Speaker. And uh, as leaders, we should avoid taking that direction, Honorable Speaker. This is a time, Honorable Speaker, we are talking about a massacre of close to 100 Kenyans. And worst of all, Madam Speaker, is that the people who have suffered the most under this character are children. Young children. And we have this radicalization. People are being told to fast, make their children, then their husbands, then finally themselves to fast and die to be able to meet Jesus. But Honorable Speaker, it's not just members of parliament who are now here pointing fingers at each other. Look at our security agencies. NIS is pointing fingers at the police. The police are saying we have done our bit, pointing fingers at the judiciary. I am here to see who the judiciary will point fingers at, but they will also point their fingers back at the police to say the police did not conduct adequate investigations but this honorable speaker does not solve the problem before us. And as leaders, we must dissuade ourselves and discourage each other from using opportunities like this that touch on the lives of our people to do cheap politics. Honorable speaker, when 73 to 75 people, and I'm sure they are still exhuming more bodies, are dying in a village, as small as Shakahola village is honorable speaker, there was a chief who is being paid by the government. And you know, when I listened to the Honorable Mbeyu ask where I was the lead, deputy leader of minority who is from a neighboring constituency, I wondered, you are the women rep. I would dare ask you, where were you? At least the deputy leader of minority has brought a motion for us to discuss and come up pro possibly with laws and we must not make this a talk show. We are will just pick and it ends there. I will ch challenge the Honorable uh, Gatrin Bay to come up with a law, probably. Or any one of us, we challenge ourselves to come up with laws that will see to it that no more Kenyans are radicalized with the pretext of religion, Honorable Speaker. Be it Christianity, be it Hinduism, be it Islam, Honorable Speaker. And I agree with what the President said yesterday, this is a terrorist who should be dealt with as a terrorist, together with those who are prefecting people as they fast in the bushes, Honorable Speaker. But we must also speak to the government of the day. It is true this has been going on since 2017. Those who are there ahead of you might have been busy with running after politicians and using NIS and other security agencies to run after politicians. Those in office today, CS Kindiki today, is a CS for the interior. And it is okay to visit Shakahola. But we want to see maximum deployment of even sniffer dogs. If we are to save one extra life today, if it is sniffer dogs that to traverse the 800 or even 8 acres of land to save one extra life from these terrorists, let us see that deployment of security forces and all other equipment and whatever they will use to save the lives, even as a continuing exhumed bodies. But Honorable Speaker, I support this motion and commend the Honorable Owen Bayer for having taken up the role, his role as a leader from Kilifi. Yes. And I must say it is rather shaming to watch as I sit here what the Honorable uh, Women for Kilifi was attempting to do, Honorable Speaker, to play very cheap politics, Honorable Speaker. And I want to really beg that even as we discuss this issue, we discuss it with the my. We, 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 we. Thank you.
Thank you. Honorable Majority Leader will not add. It is an adjournment motion. Five minutes. Minority Leader.